Welcome back to V Vlogs. <laughs> I'm so freaked out. I'm home alone right now. Ty does not know I'm filming this because he's out. But something just happened to me and I'm so spooked that like I'm sitting in my living room with Winnie just like waiting for him to get home. So basically I had to film videos this morning. So I started about an hour ago and because I'm filming, Ty was like, well, I'll just go to the grocery store while you're filming. It just makes more sense. So I set up my studio and I always film with my office door closed. It just makes it less echo and just better so I was filming did my first video everything was fine did my second video which you guys won't see until Tuesday but this video was very like just extra creepy I know all my videos are scary but it was just like extra spooky and sometimes if I'm filming home alone I just feel weird like filming scary videos so towards the end of the video I was feeling a little bit spooked turned it off finished it and in my head, I was like, why do I feel like when I open the closet in my office, something's gonna scare me? I just had this like intuition that something about my closet wasn't right. So finished filming, walked over to my closet because I put away like all of my equipment into my closet in the office. I opened the door, super dark in there. So I'm like, let me turn the light on. Turn the light on, tell me why. As I'm walking into the closet to put my equipment away, there's this loud sound and the light suddenly shuts off. And I was like, you're joking me. <laughs> this can't be real right now. So I go over, I start flickering the light and it won't turn on. So obviously like, I don't know, the light just went out, but what a coincidence that in that moment that happened. So I just got so spooked, started hearing weird scuttling noises in the house. Scuttling, scurrying like footstep sounds in the house. So now I'm here with Winnie, she's keeping me company. And I think I just heard Ty come home. So thank goodness. So we're gonna go say hi to him because I'm scared. <laughs> he has all the groceries, all the good foods. Winnie, Ty's home to save us. He's home to save us. Let's go see him. Let's go see who's here. Ty got the groceries. Let's, why are you limping? He has a limp for some reason. Is it because we were playing too hard yesterday? Is that why? Let's go see Ty, come. Something scary happened. Okay. <laughs> what do you want me to do about it? I'm just glad you're home. Okay. I'm just so glad you're home. Well, what constitutes scary? <laughs> I'll tell you Are that. you talking about a bug on the wall? No. Okay. I love how you just assume that. Because that's about 90% what it usually is. <laughs> Always no bug. A spider then. Oh, I was filming a scary video and then I went to put my equipment away in the, in the closet, <laughs> turned on the light, okay, walked in to put away my sound equipment. The light shuts off on me, goes off. So then I go and try to flicker it again and it's off, it's not working at all. So the light burnt out. Yes, but it was during a spooky video. So I just need to replace the light then. Yeah, but you're not getting it. Well, I didn't get light, so unfortunately no, you're stuck with a dark room right now. It was a, such a weird coincidence, that's what I'm saying. And a coincidence is what it is. Maybe. He don't believe me. He don't believe me. Bring in your groceries. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys what I mean. <laughs> and it's like not even a big deal unless you were actually there with me experiencing this. Okay, so this is where I just filmed. Right? So this is all like my sound equipment that I keep in the closet over there. So I was on my way to put these in there, right? Watch. The light is not turning on. And it was on until I walked in there and then it was like and turned off in the middle of me being in this dark closet. Okay, some might say it's a coincidence. Others might say something else, so. On a lighter note though, <laughs> We have a few new things in the house right now. Not really new furniture items, but I found this cute pillow on Etsy that kind of helps tie in the, the lamp a little bit. Um, we're still waiting on our like picture to go on the wall there, but now I've brought the black from the lamp onto the chair, which I think works. And then I got those slippers from Amazon. And then because it's fall, I got this cute little like string of leaf lights from Amazon. You're probably not gonna be able to see them light up too well. 
in the daytime. But that's one side. I got two just to make it look a little bit more full. And you can't see these battery packs from far away. Oh, I'm stuck to it. Oh no, oh no. Okay, I ruined it, oh my goodness. Stand by. So, I mean, it's hard to tell in the daytime, but it looks really cute at night. We just need to find like a decor piece that we can put above there, but that's our new stuff. The camera is all full of stuff. Using my shirt. All right guys, so since we're on the creepy train, today. I thought I would give you an update on something that Ty actually just reminded me of. So I told him that the other day I did a Ronald McDonald video on my channel and he was like, wait, Jess, do you remember those old VHS Ronald McDonald movies back in like the 90s? And I was like, not really. 90s, early 2000s. And then he started like talking about them more and I was like, wait, I kind of have a memory of there being like VHS McDonald's movies that were kind of weird. Like they had this like eerie vibe to them. So then I went to do some research online and there were so many people on Reddit putting posts like, do you guys remember those old McDonald's like movies? Hey guys, do you remember those lost McDonald's tapes? And like no one could figure out what they were called, what they looked like, like no one could figure it out until I found one Reddit post. I was like deep in the Reddit sphere. And I found out the name of this old VHS tape. It's called The Wacky Adventures of Ronald McDonald. And it came out in 1998 and they discontinued in 2003. Is that what you're talking about? Because that's what I remember. I think so. Like the animation style looks a little different, but like how many videos were there? A hundred or forty, sorry, I think. <laughs> it's like a hundred is like, whoa. Yeah, it actually says a total, oh, just six. Just six? A total of six 40 minute episodes were released on VHS in participating McDonald's restaurants. So basically you would actually get these VHS tapes from a McDonald's restaurant, which is weird. Like you would, that would never happen anymore. I don't know how we had them. I'm not sure if it was like good old fashioned 90s, you know, we pay to get advertised to sort of mentality. Yeah. But the one that I remember was like they were on like a boat of some sort and there was like the Kraken there and I guess they beat the Kraken with the power of friendship and like excessive amounts of calories. Okay, so let me tell you the, the episode names. So the very first episode that was ever released on VHS was called Scared Silly. And this episode scared kids so much and it was kind of like a bad first episode to put out because some kids just were too afraid to keep watching the series. But yeah, it was called Scared Silly and it was about a haunted house. Ronald and his friends were out on a camping trip and they stumble across this haunted house that is haunted by this ghost. I believe it's called Far Flung Phantom. And so there's this thunderstorm and they all have to take shelter inside this haunted house. And apparently it's such an eerie episode that scared a lot of kids. So that was the very first episode that came out. And then they had one called The Legend of Grimace Island, which I think might that's be the one the that one you that saw. I'm thinking of. And that's one thing I've never understood. Why was one of the mascots Grimace? I don't know. Like Grimace is usually a face somebody makes when they're not feeling well. Oh yeah, you Grimace. You Grimace, you go. <laughs> You figured that wouldn't be what you want for a restaurant chain. Yeah. And he was just like a big purple thing. Yeah. It's so weird how they don't really advertise those characters anymore because they had the McNuggets, they had Grimace, they had that girl with pink tails. Remember? I don't she had like two ponytails. Wasn't there the Hamburglar as there well? There was a Hamburglar. Obviously Ronald McDonald, there was like a whole group of them and they were all in this series. So the third VHS was called The Visitors from Outer Space. I don't know if you remember that one. No. Then there was Birthday World. That sounds very interesting. You figure they'd have one maybe set in like the play place that they have. Inside actual McDonald's? Maybe. Then there's called Have Time, We'll Travel. And the last one that ever came out was The Monster of McDonald Land Lock. Why do they, see this is the weird thing. They're already sort of creepy concepts and then they add scary episodes. It's so strange. But I remember every single VHS would have a segment at the start where it was the main actor who did all the advertising for yeah. McDonald's dressed up as Ronald McDonald. I'm not sure who that guy is, but it was like a live action thing where he was like, in like a playhouse sort of thing. Ew, and then what? he like jumps down a slide, I think. And that's when he becomes animated. Are you sure that wasn't just like a old McDonald's like commercial from the 90s? I don't know. I, I swear this is how every single one of them started. Yeah. Anyways, these are like the lost McDonald's episodes that some people remember, some people don't, but Reddit is a great place to find 
you know, information if you're wondering if something actually was real or not. If you guys remember these VHS tapes, comment down below. I know my audience probably wasn't born until the 2000s. Ty and I, I was born in 1994, you were 1995. So these were like a part of our childhood to a, quite a large extent. So anyways, just wanted to bring that up because I just did a McDonald's video and it was kind of interesting to like go back into our childhood to find these like old creepy VHS tapes. It'd be so cool to like watch them. But we don't even have a player anymore. Do you guys I know what VHS tapes are? have <laughs> somewhere, just not here. I think my dad still has one, but like, okay. yeah. the old times, the old days. Yeah, I don't even remember if these VHSs were of my possession or not. I just remember having access to yeah. them. They just showed up. I think that's probably for everybody. They just showed up. Yeah, that's even what's creepier. People said that too. They were like, I don't know where we got them from, but we had them. It's like, oh. Interesting. Anyways guys, if you remember, comment down below and if you like these follow-up videos, give this video a thumbs up and let us know. By the way, there's a huge sale on the merch website right now. A lot of stuff, the prices have been reduced for the end of August. So we'll leave a link down below in the description if you wanna go check it out. And yeah, I hope you have an awesome rest of your day and we'll see you in our next vlog. Bye. See you guys.